Hey, what's up guys, Joseph Gonzalez here. So I was just chatting with one of our agents who's been in our program for coming up on five months. Uh, she just went to two listing appointments. She's pretty sure she's gonna get one of them and it's gonna be for over $350,000. All the leads that she's typically getting are about that price point. And I wanted to make this video because we have a lot of agents who are like, well, why do you make us commit for three months? Reality is we wanna see you commit for six months plus because what happens is the leads start and most markets will start coming in at month two to three, end of month two, beginning of month three, when the snowball effect actually starts happening. Now, some will take a bit longer, some will take a little bit shorter amount of time. But most agents who are not business owners or have never run a business before don't realize this and don't understand that the longer you're in the game, the more numbers you get, and you're looking at a one to 2% conversion rate across the real estate industry. If you're at 100, 200, 300 leads, 400, 500, 600 leads, right? They start adding up, your conversion starts increasing. And most agents just don't really get that. Most people don't understand that. It's a numbers game, it truly is. And I'm explaining the numbers as simple as I possibly can. If you're looking at a one to 2% conversion rate and you expect to close a deal off of 60 leads, well, you're not gonna close the deal. You have to make sure that the numbers are there and then you have to make sure that your follow-up is there. So I wanna make this video to clear things up for a lot of agents that are out there that are going, you know, I'm gonna do this for a month to see if it works. That's not how the game works, guys. The game does not work on you thinking that you're gonna close the deal the first month. Yes, we have some agents that close the deal in the first month, but typically we're talking about late month two, month three, and sometimes it takes a little bit longer. And so whenever we're talking about $99 of ad spend and we have agents that are freaking out about $99, you might be in the wrong business. And I'm not here to bash agents. I just wanna make sure that expectations are set and people really understand how to run a business. $99 a month to run a business to get listing leads is not a lot of money. Even if you were calling leads yourself, you still have to pay for a dialer. You still have to pay for the list of leads to come in and it still costs more than that. So for agents who are saying, hey, how long does it take? How long do I have to be in the program? Why do I have to commit for three months? That's why, and it's not a lot of money. Now, for some people and some agents it is, but you've got to start closing deals and you got to understand what your ROI is. So if $99 a month, let's call it $300 for three months or 495 if you're in our 495 program and you add $50 for the follow-up, it's not a lot of money for running a real estate business and getting listing leads. And yes, you do have to pay a referral. And yes, we charge a referral fee that is quote unquote standard, whatever that means. Um, for each deal that closes. But even then, your ROI is out of the roof. So anyway, for those of you who are wondering why we charge a referral fee and why we say stay in for at least three months, again, we would like you to be in for six months, that's why, because we know you pay money, $1,500, $1,000 for programs that you actually never use. And we're actually doing the work for you, so you don't have to worry about going in and doing all these other things. So I uh, hope this clears things up. If you want more information, please let me know. Share this with other agents who don't know how to run a business and don't know that if you are spending money, there has to be an ROI there, but it may take some time. Anyway, thanks for listening. Talk to you soon.